Hi again, everybody. Um, I want to say thank you for entering my raffle to everyone who did so and for giving me all those really good ideas about bags. Um, and congratulations to the lady who won. Um, I'm going to be making her project very soon, hopefully starting next week. Um, and then I'll get back onto my waiting list. So please follow the link in my pinned post on my page if you'd like to join the waiting list. Um, I'm hoping to get through it a little bit faster now. Um, but I'm making this video mainly because I finished that personal project I gave you a little sneak peek of um, earlier. Um, and I made this bag from a pattern. So this pattern was the Speedwell Sling Bag from Blue Color. Um, it's not a free pattern, but it is pretty easy to follow. Um, there are some bits that are a bit tricky, but mainly it was just preparing all the parts for this bag that took so long. Um, I want to show you my pattern folder as well. It's my pattern folder, and you can see it's pretty beefy. This is half of half patterns that I've bought or downloaded for free, and half patterns that I've developed myself a little bit. Um, but I like adding to this folder as well. So there we go. So onto the bag. Here we go. The Blue Color Speedwell Backpack Sling Bag. Um, so this took a lot of time to prepare, mainly because I was waiting to get some of the Toki Pops fabric and I really wanted laminated fabric um, so it was thicker um, and just so it'd be a bit more durable, I think. Um, and I paired it with this Charisse, oh, Fuchsia, that's it, Fuchsia cork fabric, because um, I think it goes really, really well with this. And not normal webbing strap, this is a canvas webbing, um, but I really wanted to try canvas webbing on a bag. Um, so here it is. It's not super big, but so here's, a be quick for size comparison but it's it's quite roomy inside so I'll show you what's inside so we've got I bought a heart turn lock instead of a normal turn lock and that opens out the front pocket so the front pocket's got a little zipper pocket which I think fits my phone I've not actually tried it in there yeah it does it does fit my phone so my phone will fit in there quite nicely um, little bit tight it might go in sideways I've not really tried it yeah it goes in sideways there we go so it fits my phone which is a iPhone 6s it's got a slip pocket in there as well um, and just the, the rest of the pocket there I've not really seen what sort of fits in there so I've got my thrifty again that fits in quite nicely and it'll do up at the sides there we go or a small set piece, maybe even a medium because it's quite tall actually that pocket and it can goes up into here as well. So there we go, get my phone back up again. Um, I chose pink and blue lining because the blue lining is the Toki Pop sort of original coloured lining. Um, but I just like the pink to go with the outside as well. So that's the front pocket. I pick metal zippers as well, but they're a bit stiff to do up at the moment. Um, I'm putting some wax on them, so it's loosen them up a little bit, and hopefully with some wear it'll get a bit freer. And there's the main pocket. You can see it, okay. So on the back, I put another zipper panel in, um, and you see that mesh pocket, pocket at the bottom? Just there. Um, it's quite roomy inside. On the front, it's got just another slip pocket. The original pattern called for two slip pockets, so a slip pocket on this side and a slip pocket on this side, but I chose to go with just the one on the front. So it's quite roomy in there. This is my normal nappy changing quip, and that fits in there. Fits in fine. With other bits and pieces, it'll fit in fine. So it all does up with the turn lock, and it's a sling one shoulder backpack. If you want to ask any questions about it, um, please message me or I'll post some photos of it. Um, 
later today. Uh, so please let me know what you think. Thank you for watching. Bye.